The NFL playoffs are here, and this matchup on Wild Card Weekend is brought to you by EA Sports. It's the Giants and the Niners, and it's all up next. It was a frequent sight in the 80s and 90s, and it's continued on till today. Playoff football in the Bay Area as we welcome you to Levi Stadium in Santa Clara. Tonight, it's the second game here on this wild card Saturday as it'll be the New York Giants taking on the San Francisco 49ers. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the postseason on EA Sports. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. And Charles, that's really all I need to say to get you fired up. It's the postseason on EA. So here are the Giants ready to start their initial drive of the game. And they will be led out by a man in his sophomore campaign as the quarterback. And as we continually grade players, especially quarterbacks, how about this young man, second year in the NFL, guided his team into the playoffs, and now he wants to show the world that they should buy in on him because he wants to evolve from that young quarterback to that true team leader that takes his team deep in the playoffs. And he's upended after a gain of two out to the 27. Brandon, once that one broke down, there were only so many options left for him to take. Fortunately, only first down, so he smartly got the yardage he could get and didn't worry about trying to turn into a bigger play and end up taking a bigger loss. Here, they hope they can regroup and get something different going here on second down. First catch of this wild card game for a 1,000-yard receiver in the regular season. He's got a first down, too. They run with a dangerous Saquon Barkley. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. From the 46, here's a second and seven. Looking to throw. And that nearly an interception here on this opening drive, but he gets a reprieve. It's third down. So seven yards from the first down here as they come up to the line of scrimmage. On third down, he'll drop to throw. And that ball incomplete, nearly intercepted. Took a chance with that one. It'll lead to a fourth down. So the Giants getting the football back here for their second drive. Over on the sideline, hoping to hit that reset button between possessions. Last time out, they had to punt it away. This time, hoping to finish this thing off in the end zone. Now this thrown deep for Slayton. And he bats it away, and it falls down incomplete. Offenses all over continue to be aggressive, and most people never turn down a shot at a deep ball. But oftentimes, it attracts a little bit of extra attention, and it did on that play, and that one got knocked away. And second and ten, he'll look to throw again. And his throw is incomplete. This defense has passed its first two tests by forcing back-to-back -back incompletions. They know there's probably another throw coming out third down. Let's see if they decide to force the issue by sending people on a blitz. Now the throw on third down, knocked away and incomplete. set to take the field they trail early on the road in the playoffs not a great combination as they've got it first and ten now this one complete to Corey Davis and he has a big gain inside the 40 before being dropped that one good for 37 yards. Ah, uh, so often when we're watching a football game, we see one with a lot of ebbs and flows, and this one is no different. And sometimes you just need a big play to wake you up a bit. And they get one right there. That shot of caffeine this offense was looking for. And he gets it all the way down inside the 10 and mark him at the 5. 33 yards that time. They'll try and run for it with Barkley. And yeah, he'll work 
free from one tackle, but that's about all as he's taken down. And hold on here, because on that last run, it looks like we have a player who was shaken up. But hopefully, obviously, nothing serious here. Medical staff, though, is going to take a peek. And he is in. Touchdown, New York. A touchdown run there from a yard out. And the Giants are back within a score. Well, that was a quick drive. The passing game set it up. The New York set to take the field. As this offense comes back out here, Charles, they're trailing in this ball game. And they've been on the sideline for a while. They did score their last time out, but they just had to watch that long, sustained drive. So we'll see if they can shake the rust off. Yeah, and that's always a question that you have when you have to come off the bench after having sat there for a long time. Are you ready to go? Are you loosened up? But even more so, are you mentally alert and ready to put your best product out there? A first down carry for Barkley. And boy, this defense again really making things tough on him as they stop him for no gain. Now a second and ten. All runners count on their eyes to find the gaps and creases to find open space. There was absolutely none on that one. Totally swallowed up on that play. They try to throw on second down, but this one is incomplete. So another incompletion there. He's hitting on fewer than half his pass attempts in this one, and that is not a winning formula. Yes, yeah, so let's make sure we give a little bit of credit to the defense here. They're giving a lot to think about, a lot of different looks. He seems a little bit confused trying to complete passes. His first catch of this wild card game, and it's good for a first down. Well, these guys have definitely been outplayed in the first half. I like their countenance. I like the way that they haven't panicked out there, the way they're carrying themselves. They're starting to move the ball, and what you have to do, maintain your poise, and start to put together some drives. And the running lane's non-existent in this first half as they'll stop him behind the line. Here we go on second and 12. Incomplete. I would say it would probably be a good idea for him to reintroduce himself to his receivers at the half because they're definitely on different wavelengths. But I also don't advocate waiting that long. Next series before you get out there. Hey, let's get together, guys. Let's get this thing moving. And down he goes. The 49ers get there. Oh, hang on. take a glance at the offense as they work their way back out for their first possession of the second half. They'll try and start this drive in the air. And oh, that nearly their first pick of the game, but it falls down to the ground incomplete. So following the incompletion, here's second and 10 from the 25. They'll look to throw, eluding the pressure right. Still staying on his feet, are you serious? And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. Big yardage there on the scramble, it gets him a first down. I am willing to bet that he got a monster grin on his face when he saw what was happening. Man covers were so committed to denying a big throw that it pulled attention away from him and he had an easy lane to hit and hit it he did. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. He'll look to throw. And he'll have a gain of three to the 33. His running ability has been an extra dimension of the game plan thus far. For once, though, he didn't create any magic against the front. There's prepared for him to try and take off. Here's the second and seven. And that almost their first INT of the ball game. Had his sights on it, but he couldn't seal the deal. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. He'll drop to throw. And oh, that's going to wind up incomplete. Nearly their first pick of the game, but it does bring up fourth down. Fourth down now as San Fran. Giants. On first down, he'll drop to throw. And that is incomplete. Now oh, the coverage a little too good there, and it's second down. 
Now before the second down play, we'll get whistles and a timeout. It's just their first, so two remaining as they burn one here in this third quarter. That ball caught by Slayton. Touchdown! Darius Slayton, 23 yards for the touchdown. And the Giants take the force turnover on defense and convert it into six points. Trying to make a comeback often appears daunting, but the only way to get there... Possession of the football going back over to the Giants. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. He's got this complete to Robinson. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. A well-executed 22-yard gain. Inside four minutes to go, third quarter. They'll look to throw now on first down. Gets this out to Saquon Barkley. And all the way in, touchdown, New York. Saquon Barkley. He scored on the ground and through the air. And the Giants have got it back to within a score. Well, forget about the weapons out wide. He knows he's got another weapon in the backfield of the passing game, Charles, and he utilized him perfectly on that play. And the offense coordinator showed me something on that play, Brandon, because so often during a game, our cameras find them looking down at their play sheets, and you wonder if they're absorbing anything. He had something specific in mind, and he went to it, and it worked well. They'll try and throw for it. Over the middle, and there's a diving catch. I guess the coach looked at the two-point cheat sheet, said go for it, get it to a three-point game, and they did it. Yeah, and sometimes you just throw out time of game. You don't worry about that. There's just a feel sometimes in making that call, and he felt good about what he had for a two-point conversion, and now they're only down three and feeling great about themselves. following a good pickup of eight. Well, he's proven real effective running the football. No one open, don't force it. Just get what you can, and that's what he's done very well in this game. This one goes out wide for Barkley. And he goes out of bounds just shy of the 45. That'll be a pickup of 10 as they try to recover from this 10-point deficit. Well, every drive from here out is definitely crucial and critical. They know that they need to get at least three here to get it back to a one-score game. But I can't imagine that in their huddle that they're thinking at all about getting a field goal. They want to get into the end zone. Oh, what a juke into space! And he'll be out of bounds just shy of the 40. 15 more there, and they're on a roll. It's another first down. First down. Giants. Back to throw. And that one drops down incomplete. Good coverage there. Forced the ball free, and it's second down. And partner to me, that one was all about timing. If he's there too early, it's going to be a pass interference call. If he's too late, it's a completed pass. He was Johnny on the spot on that one. Now, meanwhile, a pass that should have been intercepted, but it winds up falling incomplete. All oh, this defense knows. Fourth quarter, they need to make the play. That one was right for the taking. Could have changed the complexion of the ball game, but it winds up incomplete. Now, yet another incompletion here as they fail to connect on third. Might be a little bit of frustration there. Back-to-back -back incompletions. Receivers blanketed on both attempts. This time, I'm... Here's the giant offense now as they get ready to take over here. Hurry, hurry. Hurry, hurry. 
They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. Over the middle, he completes it to Robinson. And he'll be upended at the 28-yard line. Just a three-yard gain there. Here's second and seven now from the 28. Now back to throw. They'll get this out to Barkley complete. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. First down, the Giants. They'll look to throw here on first down. And oh, that nearly their first pick of the game, but it falls down to the ground incomplete. Now the Giants will use the second of their three timeouts. That's going to leave them with just one remaining here in this fourth quarter. Another throw on second down, and this one incomplete as well. When you're leading in the final quarter, your radar has to be up for any potential deep shots. And probably not the last one they're going to see in this game, not as long as they hold this lead. Back to throw again. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And they will touch him down, but not before he gets the first. A gain of 26 yards. First down, New York. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. He finds his man complete. It's Graves. And down inside the 15 he goes. This game not quite as good as the last, but still over 40 yards between the two. Again, he'll drop to throw. Toward the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. That certainly appeared to be a play call where they were just trying to make second down, second and short. I think they thought the coverage was off a little bit more than it was. Nice job there pressing up on it. And for touchdown, Giants! Darius Slayton, two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Giants have made it a one-score game again here in the fourth. they want to hear that right now maybe not at the moment but once they get away from it a little bit and they get into their off-season program and they'll start to talk about that and I like how you framed it Who was that? That wasn't us out there. <laughs> 